Hello, I'm the critic. I remember it because I remember it. Yeah, whatever. We are going to talk about... I can't believe I'm saying this, but... The Night of the Living Dummy episodes of Goosebumps. But before I get started... <coughs> I'm going to be a little greedy with my subscribers, and I would like, I'm going to say 50 to 15 likes, mm -hmm. and at least 10 more people to subscribe, because I hate goosebumps. I just want you to know that I'm doing this for you people, for you out there who like this stuff. And if you want, I'll even do, um, I'll even do, um, Nightmare on Elm Street, and, um, the guy with the hockey mask. Tell me, tell me what those are called in, on the comments below. Friday the Thirteenth. I'll be doing, and if you want to, uh, I'll also be doing uh, Friday the Thirteenth. Not me on Elm Street. Halloween. And Chucky, if you want. Mm -mm, I'm lonely. So let's talk about it. I just saw this show recently. And the Night of the Living Dummy was weird, 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 and weird. Because it just was. I don't know why it just was. So let's talk about it, because I don't really know much about it, but from what I know is, it's about this puppet who comes alive and assumedly does what we did in the 30s or 40s, um, take little children and make them work. Now, I haven't read any of these, but I hate puppets. I just want you to know that. I hate anything that goes bump in the night. Or basically anything like that. It's scary to me. And creepy. Connie. So yeah, if you don't like it, I'm sorry. I don't really know much about it, but this is what happens when somebody asks me to do a requested review. Oh, and I have a Patreon now. Go fund that. If you subscribe to this, it will go right to my Patreon.